John Greenway and I farm here on Maypole Farm to alleviate the troubles on the farm we've got our old drill back we took the Stara back to the dealers we told them of our plight and told them that we'd purchase one at a later date so uh, at the moment we've got this little thing which although old it does do the job nicely for now and uh, we have this one field left to get drilled uh, putting oil seed rape in it and uh, yeah so we've got a bit more of an healthy bank balance to what we had. It's uh, a bit older equipment again, but we will, <coughs> as we come round for the harvest in the next season, should make a good bit of money, pay a bit of the loan off, and uh, not have to buy too much equipment, which is always good. There we go. Almost back around now. Yeah, we've still got some seed left, which will, if we've got any left at the end of it, will go into the one of the sheds and used for storage and we'll come in for the next season's crop we drill you see this drill is working well for an old thing we will get ourselves around three times and go straight up and down the field and that will then do us so now that is hopefully we've got around that corner nicely we have missed a piece there with the looks of things we shall pop back and just drop the drill down make sure we catch everything this breed here we go now that will be the second time round for that <coughs> excuse me so yeah we've got once we get this done we've got all of our crops drilled and uh, Just have to keep our fingers crossed that everything grows well and see where we go from there. The future of our farm hangs on this first season. I mean, if we can have a decent first season, it gives hope for every season that's to follow. And, uh, we will then be able to move forward a little more confidently. At the minute, I do sleepless nights. 
took on the £800,000 loan and then after we took it out spent the money building the farmyard up a bit and sorting everything else out and then the next thought goes through your head oh, what the hell have I done I now have a massive bank loan which needs to be paid back starting with the next season's crops and so uh, you do worry no no way you can stop yourself worrying at any time I think when you're farming but when you are starting off with a small farm and got such a big loan on that farm then I think maybe you tend to worry a little more than you would normally. I will let you know the answer to that of course once we start getting the harvest in this next season. So far we've got one or two farmers in the area who often need a bit of work doing, so they are a big help to us. Because without doing work for those one or two farmers in the area, we would have gone under by now. And selling the newest drill we had and getting this old thing back, but. Uh, Our drill as and when we can. Down here we go again. Yeah, we are almost around the final headland. tractor with terror tires on isn't I don't think the best of options just jump off and have a look and see what it's like for width wise for the drill I think it's, it's just slightly narrower than the actual drill so uh, one more breed left to do down here. The good thing is that you can keep your seed wheels tight onto the last breed that was taken and that's then almost it for that. Now we shall find ourselves a straight edge. straight up and down mode of it. Now we shall start you know, straight up and down this edge. Gives us a nice straight edge to run on. And around and turn. I've got a lot of ground to do at the moment, so this drill is pretty good for us at the minute. It is going to be good. So I will stop jabbering and let you see a bit of the work.
think when we start fertilizing and spraying we will use the the beer just because we've got the wheels for it already without buying anything extra we bought this with the standard wheels and with the terror tires with it whereas the Fiat came with its normal wheels and the row crop wheels We have got GoPro spell. There we go. Well, sorry, we dropped the camera we was recording with, so uh, happens now and again. I seem to drop it more and more. So. Get some of this get this drilling done then we'll have a look and see there is one or two jobs I know that people are wanting doing in the area. We may spread some fertilizer on this and then go and sort those jobs out. I don't think we need much fertilizer with the land we've got at the moment. Prize fund. I know some of Palmer State said they'd let you know about it. They asked me to pass on what it was all about. The giant took a great announcement. Uh, some of Palmer States told me that to them it wasn't that great of an announcement. And that was something along the lines of DLC or something would have been a bigger announcement but uh, I guess that's down to the fact that they do a YouTube channel and are not in the young age bracket by any chance so uh, Doubtful whether some of Palmer States would be allowed in the Palmer Simulator Championship even if wanted to go in, so that's probably why. At the moment, we are halfway through this drilling, I think. Yeah, some of Palmer States wanted to let you know that the great announcement was about the Palmer Simulator Championship. They've teamed up with eSports. Uh, 
and some of our mistakes told me to say that it is going to probably get more exposure from for YouTube channels due to the fact of more interesting farming simulator because new people who are into esports may well watch some of the content to see what it's all about. Probably some of the esports people haven't seen Palmy Simulator before. And we wish everyone who enters Palmy Simulator Championships through esports all the luck in the world. Hope you all have a successful and happy time farming in the championship. I guess it was very big good news for Giants because it's going to get the game seen by an all new audience and more sales, so uh, yeah, congratulations on that. We're on uh, almost across. start to get shorter soon again so uh, we've got, just about got the longest part of the field done Shining lovely today. And, uh, this sun is going to very much improve the rumination rate for winter. This seed rate is arrow. He's one of the newer varieties of oil seed rape so that we give it a try it's supposed to yield better as time will tell on that it's say a new variety one of the new varieties and uh, a bit of an unknown quantity although some farmers do it last year but last year was a really hot summer and uh, everything was down on what it normally is so uh, could well be that whatever production came off it it was uh, down on what it should have been due to the weather. My feeling is if we get some otter summers there may well be some varieties grown abroad coming over. Because uh, People will want to have crops do well in dry weather. But we shall see on that. At the moment, I'm 
we're just starting up. It probably wasn't the best time to buy a farm. We're still awaiting to see what happens with Brexit and how it may affect our sales from the farm and the inputs of our fertilizers and things like that. So uh, very uncertain times in the farming world at the moment. And especially I suppose that we have just started off on this venture. Hopefully we can still make a living and farming will thrive. There are two ways to look at it that it will come out of the European market and food may well become more readily available in the supermarkets instead of feeds from abroad. Or if they do a deal where we keep trading with Europe then nothing changes which also is beneficial that we are working on a playing field that we know. couple more breeds to do and then we shall leave you until the next vlog we do which will probably end up being putting some fertilizer down on the field and it's doing a great job already done four hours on the farm so uh, shall have one more round probably three breeds and we shall be done here so all that's left to say is that you've enjoyed this vlog Please give it a like, give it a share, if you are new to Summer Farm Estates channel and would like to see more of the work that appears here, please subscribe to the channel, give that bell a little tap, it will tell you when these videos are uploaded, when there's a live stream. Some of our mistakes reliably inform us the next live stream is tonight at 5 pm. And they are also now starting Friday live streams from 5 pm as well. So this Friday we'll see the first of the Friday live streams. And that is all done. So we should go to the yard. So all that's left to say is. Thank you for watching. Until uh, next time, this is John Greenway on Maypole Farm. So goodbye for now and take care. <laughs>